Goes arrows one and four against New Orleans as we get started here with Foley taking the ball, setting it up. Strong runs from him every time he touches the ball lately. They, they've been crisping in the uh, backfield play, but they're about 25 meters behind where they started and uh, the arrow defense is doing a decent job. Uh, speaking of D, we've slipped up here. They've got Howard inside. If he can find him, he might be able to find the line. Devro there, he's got support. Looking to move that ball quick. I think that's Dolan. The arrows taking another penalty, so New Orleans with advantage. And they're in. Dolan, or is that? Nola with a great attacking opportunity there. They had been going backwards on D with the arrows, really stepping it up, but a couple passes out the back. They find space down that sideline and they capitalize scoring five here. Getting things started for New Orleans here. And Eric Howard had a lot to do with that. He was in great support. And there's a great conversion right there. Arrows with strong body positioning there. Bailey right in the mix as always with Cellini. Boys getting a good push on the crowd, getting into it now. We see Weta number 12 joining in. Sammy Malcolm's there too, and the boys are in. Five points for the Arrows off the back of that driving mall. Terrific stuff by the Arrows. Great attacking opportunity there. They had been going backwards on D with the Arrows, really stepping it up. See if we've got anybody warming up on the sideline, ready to jump on. I guess it would be Tommy De La Vega. Looking forward to seeing him back in the lineup. And there's a great conversion by Sammy Malcolm. Huge kick on the tough angle all the way from the 10 meter line. It's up. Does he have the distance? He does. But advantage for Nola here. Might see a little cheeky chip. And John Sheridan covering. <coughs> Bounce goes to Weta. No advantage there. I saw you. The arrows are going to have to make some adjustments in defense to uh, tighten that up. The flags go up, three points for Nola, gold, 10-10. If there's a penalty to be had here, the arm will be going up to the blue. We will see. Donardo moving it, he's got Weta. Sam Malcolm spinning around, Weta still with it, and he is in for seven under the post. What a run. You said he ran hard, Jamie, he certainly does. Spencer Jones right with him there. Stopping him behind the line. Killing some of Arrow's momentum here. Let's see if they can get back into their uh, their structure. Sam Malcolm, lovely little ball to Sheridan. He cuts off the right foot. One to beat, and he is in. What a run by John Sheridan. The fans loving it. Denardo spins it right, and it's Malcolm again. And Sheridan wouldn't be stopped. He was sniffing for between the posts, but he got darn close, and this yeah, should be... Uh... To potentially put the arrows up by 14. Flags go up. Arrows, 24 to 10. They might be uh, running sideline to sideline as Spencer Jones takes this one up. He finds Shepard. He's got Richardson in space. Richardson with the gas to finish this as he goes for the corner. Early response from the arrows. And that is some exciting stuff. Rugby, in the last two weeks, they have certainly done that. Mike Shepard, the skipper, in support, takes the last defender off, pops it up. Mitch Richardson in the corner. After a stint in Japan playing for Kamaishi, uh, had the chance to speak to him, and he loved the, uh, the opportunity to be playing over there. And but he's such a brave player for What a size. move by the arrows. Set piece straight off the training ground. Cole Keith, yeah. he's in again. Look at that. Absolutely lovely play. Purpose uh, about an hour ago and thought maybe they could uh, steal this one from the arrows, but the uh, blue shirts aren't going to be denied. Great set piece play, as you said. It's up. It's over. No, he dragged him along the ground. Denardo so searching for that ball. He's got Malcolm. Pass gone astray. We've got that picked up. Number 13, Juan Capeo. He takes it in for an easy score there. Welcome. They had a play on. I'm not sure if uh, their structure broke down, but the ball bounced right into the mitts. Capeo, he would take it the length of the field. 
And there's a seven point try. This would make it a three score game. Off the post, but cleaned up by Spencer Jones. And he's in, no, Giuseppe de Toy. Want to play attack, uh, attacking rugby, attractive rugby. And they're certainly doing that again. That's their seventh try today. And if any of the fans are wondering, no, you don't get two bonus points if you score eight tries, but that's the seventh arrow try. They're playing with confidence. They're playing with uh, cohesion. And I think now they just want to uh, work this clock and make sure everyone's healthy and uh, take this victory home. What a lovely ball, inside ball from Tyler. Sheridan takes it up. Good, good tackle by Feeks, holding them up high. A lovely inside ball. He's got tons of space. He finds McRory with support. McRory will not miss from there. Five, seven points under the post. Arrows fans loving this. So many times at every level of rugby, despite what your coaches tell you, players admire the kicks. He followed the kick. He was rewarded with a try. Good opportunity for him to get a new game like this. Hopefully get some points on the board and, and build his confidence as a young player. I was just going to mention that. I think his confidence is a bit dodgy right now, and it's an easier game to play when you're going forward. So that's a, a, a very valid point for uh, the youngster. Nola with the quick tap there, finding some space down that right sideline. Devereaux Ferris finds number 20, Malcolm May. Big William Stewart with the ball, and he hits Tongawea, and he is in for seven points under the post. The best Nola Gold player today. He's really made a statement in the centers, both offensively and defensively. Both sides of the ball, I think he's been good. Uh, unfortunately for him and his teammates, they haven't had enough ball in the second half, and uh, they're playing catch up, but uh, no one's gonna tackle him when he's got the engine running like that. The 6'2", 235 pound. Oakland, California, local. Building the drive. Arrows coming together. They're in for another score. Breaking 50. First time this season. First time in a while for the Arrows. I'm not sure if they've ever actually done that before. And out in the uh, driving malls, but uh, that's just terrific stuff. And again, half a century. Uh, Arrows wanted a victory. They wanted a bonus point victory and uh, they uh, just keep chugging along here, looking very, very positive. We see Siaki Vikalani joining in there. The last couple weeks of uh, this little homestand have been uh, very fruitful for the Arrows as they fought themselves their way back into the playoff race. And the ball is bobbled off the kickoff. Nola scooping that up, heading towards the line. Just held up short. Oh, and the try is awarded. Close out the game without allowing another score. Nola will want to have an answer for them. Feeks takes it up. He finds space. And he is in. That is the game. Five points for Nola. A little bit of afters there from Bruce. It looks like he is on the loose. McRory. What a game. A hometown crowd has to love that. Seeing a, a score line like that. They will be a little bit upset with the de defense, but great scoring today. And as we take a look at the, the moment of the match here and the absolute dagger from Mitch Richardson scoring that try.